Mercedes-Benz W212 is the fourth generation of the E-Class passenger cars of the German brand Mercedes-Benz, presented in 2009 at the Detroit Auto Show. The appearance of the model was tested on the Mercedes-Benz Concept Fascination Concept car, presented at the Paris Motor Show in 2008. Sales began in March 2009. The car included many new technical solutions and safety technologies, including driver fatigue detection systems, lane departure warnings, and traffic sign recognition technology. In April 2009, a five-seat armored version of the car, according to the VR4 class, called E-Guard went on sale. In the summer, a high-performance modification of the E63 AMG was introduced, and in December, the W212 line of cars was equipped with the optional fourth-generation formatic all-wheel drive system and replenished with a version in the station wagon, factory index, S212, and coupe, C207. In 2013, the car underwent a facelift, giving it a more modern and sporty shape. The front part of the body received a completely new look, separate front optics, leading their traditions since 1995, were combined into a model block. The design of the hood and front bumper has been updated. For the first time for the E-Class, an emblem in the form of a branded three-pointed star was installed on the radiator grille in the Elegance line. The rear of the body received an update to the lights and bumper. The model range of engines has also undergone modifications. In June 2013, the E63 AMG station wagon went on sale. The Mercedes-Benz W212 was produced in sedan, station wagon, coupe and convertible body styles. In addition, the car has modified versions from the division of Mercedes-AMG, E63 AMG, E63 AMG S, as well as third-party international tuning studios. In 2016, the model was replaced by the fifth generation of the E-Class, Mercedes-Benz W213. Story. Background. Design work on the successor to the Mercedes-Benz W211 car began in 2004 after an official development and development program was approved in 2003. In 2005, the exterior design by Thomas Stopka was approved. After discussions with engineers and final refinements, the final design specifications were frozen in 2006. Some elements of the exterior styling were borrowed from the design of the Mercedes-Benz W204 C-Class and Mercedes-Benz W221 S-Class. The bulging rear wheel arches are reminiscent of the fender flares of historic Ponton models from the 1950s. The appearance of the new car was preliminarily worked out on the Mercedes-Benz Concept Fascination Concept car presented at the Paris Motor Show in September 2008. The reputation of the predecessor car, the Mercedes-Benz W211, was marred by quality issues at launch. True lovers of the brand reacted negatively to the controversial merger of Daimler AG and Chrysler concerns, believing that the merger would have a bad effect on product quality. A few years after the collapse of Daimler Chrysler, Mercedes-Benz said that the new generation of the E-Class will embody a return to company traditions in matters of quality. 2009 to 2011. The official premiere of the new E-Class sedan for the general public took place in 2009 at the Detroit Auto Show and sales in Europe started in March. The car retained its four eyes, but diamond-shaped headlights were installed instead of oval headlights. The drag coefficient of the car, CX, of the new generation of the E-Class was 0.25. The Mercedes-Benz W212 entered the Russian market in April 2009. From a technical standpoint, the car included a host of new safety technologies, including driver fatigue detection, lane departure warning, and traffic sign recognition. Among the features that enhance handling and ride comfort, the new E-Class includes the adaptive direct control suspension, active seats, and movable grill louvers that improve the car's aerodynamic efficiency. Standard equipment also included electronic stability control, ESP, anti-lock braking system, ABS, airbags, and automatic climate control. In April 2009, a five-seat armored version of the car, according to the VR4 class, called E-Guard went on sale. The vehicle was reinforced with steel and aramid fibers, Kevlar. Bulletproof glass was installed on the windows, safe tires were mounted on 17-inch wheels, designed for speeds up to 240 km h 50 km of track at speeds up to 80 km h when flat. As a result, the E-Guard became capable of withstanding the impact of a .44 Magnum bullet. In addition, a special version of the Airmatic Air Suspension, an alarm system, an internal communication system and an armored bottom were installed on the car. The range of engines consisted of three options, 
gasoline E350 and E500, as well as diesel E350 CDI Blue Efficiency. All are available in elegance and avant-garde versions. The starting price at the start of sales was €45,000, including VAT. In the same year, the E250 Blue TEC concept model, based on the E250 CDI Blue Efficiency sedan with integrated Blue TEC system and 7G Tronic plus 7-speed automatic transmission, was presented at the New York Auto Show. Part of the eco-friendly diesel concept is a 25-liter tank of urea solution, AdBlue, from which the additive enters the exhaust stream and reduces NOx emissions. As a result, the car's 2.2-liter four-cylinder engine meets stringent Euro 6 emission standards. An AMG version of the new E-Class, E63 AMG, was also unveiled at the New York Auto Show. It was fitted with the same 6.2-liter V8 powertrain as the SL63 AMG, made it to an AMG SpeedShift MCT 7-speed automatic transmission. The car's engine generated 525 horsepower, with 386 kilowatts at 630 newton meters of torque. Acceleration from 0 to 100 km h was 4.5 seconds, the maximum speed was electronically limited to 250 km h. In December 2009, the W212 line of cars was equipped with the optional fourth-generation formatic all-wheel drive system. In the updated version of the system, the torque is divided in a ratio of 45,55 in favor of the rear wheels, in the previous generation it was 40,60. In addition, the fourth formatic adds only 70 kg to the car's weight for the E350 model and 50 kg for the E500 versus 95 for the third, which, in turn, as a beneficial effect on efficiency. Wagon S212 At the Frankfurt Motor Show in 2009, a station wagon version of the W212 was introduced. Initially, it was available with five engines, three diesels, E220 CDI, E250 CDI, and E350 CDI, all blue efficiency series, as well as two petrols, E350 CGI blue efficiency and E500 with a V8 engine. New and improved engines are more efficient than previous engines and boast fuel economy. All of them comply with the Euro 5 emission standard. Compared to its predecessor, the new station wagon is 50 mm longer, and the volume of the luggage compartment with the second row seats folded down, forming a flat loading area, remained the same, 1950 liters. In addition, the tailgate and a soft curtain that hides the contents of the compartment from prying eyes received a servo drive in all versions including the basic one. The vehicle is equipped as standard with self-leveling rear air suspension and a new and unique load box control function. Security systems include nine airbags, attention assist, and PRE safe brake electronic assistance, neck pro active head restraints, Vistronic Plus autonomous cruise control, and others. Sales in Europe started on August 5, 2009. In the USA, from June 2010, model range 2011. Coupe C207. The CLK class was replaced by the W212 Coupe, under the code C207. The official debut took place at the 79th Geneva Motor Show in 2009-15. This is the second coupe in the E-Class family after the W124 body. In the basic configuration, the E220 CDI Blue Efficiency car has a CX of only 0.24, or other modifications it is 0.27 to 0.28. The coupe is assembled at the factory in Bremen. The car comes standard with agility control suspension, thematic dual zone climate control, audio 20 CD multimedia system and new sports seats. Optionally available are Thermotronic 3 zone climate control and the command APS infotainment system with navigation maps, as well as luxurious leather covered seats with ventilation. The set of security systems includes an active hood, PRE safe, attention assist, ESP, ABS, brake assist plus and others. An adaptive main beam assist is available as an option. As with the saloon version, various options for customizing the exterior and interior of the car are available with the Elegance, Avant-Garde, and AMG Sport packages. Two new direct injection engine versions have been developed specifically for the coupe version, the E250 CGI Blue Efficiency, 150 kilowatts 204 horsepower, and the E350 CGI Blue Efficiency. 215 kilowatts 292 horsepower. The upgrade of the E250 CDI Blue Efficiency model resulted in a 17% reduction in fuel consumption, 5.1 liters per 100 kilometers on the NEDC combined cycle.
Orders for the coupe began on February 19, 2009. Deliveries to official dealers started in May. Prices including 19% VAT in Germany depended on the engine and ranged from €44,684.50 for the E250CDI Blue Efficiency to €66,045 for the E500. Extended sedan in 2010, at the Beijing Auto Show, a version of the sedan extended by 14 cm was presented. The car received the index L, its length was 5,012 mm, and the wheelbase, 3,014 mm. At the time of the debut, the company offered three variants of the car, E260 CGI Elegance, E260 CGI Avant-Garde and E300 Avant-Garde. Extended sedans are supplied exclusively to the Chinese market. Convertible, A207. The 2010 North American International Auto Show saw the debut of the E-Class Convertible, body code A207, which replaced the CLK Class Cabriolet. This is the second convertible in the E-Class family after the W124 body. The car is equipped with a fabric soft folding roof that folds or opens in 20 seconds, and this can be done either using the roof control button from the passenger compartment or a button on the key. The mechanism that drives the upper part of the body is provided by Carmen. According to Mercedes-Benz, the roof is designed for 20,000 folding cycles. The convertible comes standard with air scarf and air cap systems the former delivering warm air to the necks of the driver and front passenger, while the latter extends a spoiler from the upper windshield frame and a windscreen behind the rear seat headrests, which divert airflow as the vehicle moves. The initial lineup for the U.S. market consisted of cars with a 272-horsepower V6 3.5-liter engine, E350, and a 388-horsepower V8 5.5-liter engine, E500. For European customers, CGI and CDI Blue Efficiency Series engines, 170 to 292 horsepower, are also available. 2013 to 2016, restyling. On December 11, 2012, the first photos of the restyled E-Class appeared on the internet, in which one could see the new sedan and station wagon with the AMG Sports package, as well as their interior. After two days, Mercedes-Benz officially declassified all the detailed information about the restyled E-Class family at the North American International Auto Show. The car received a new look of the front end, a new dashboard design and a differently designed center console, as well as updated electrical equipment and a range of engines. In addition, an analog clock appeared in the cabin. Compared to the usual minor restyling of Mercedes-Benz models, the W212 received an extensive update. According to company representatives, this is the most significant facelift ever produced by the brand. It cost about 1 billion euros, and the number of new features on the updated model can be compared with the new model. The front of the car has been completely redesigned, giving it a more aggressive look. Twin headlights have been replaced with single LED daytime running lights as standard. In the previous version, they were only available on request. The grill was completely new, on which the company emblem was installed, which was previously only available for C-Class cars. The front bumper is sharper and more pointed thanks to larger air intakes. On the back of the W212, LED lights were installed. The shape of the rear doors and fenders was redesigned, eliminating the bulge of the wheel arches, which gave the car more traditional lines. The facelift model was originally available with the E350 and E500 engines, which were not changed. The E200 CGI and E250 CGI models received an update while the previous 1.8-liter CGI engine was replaced with a 2.0-liter, 1991 cubic centimeters, with the Blue Direct system. Since the autumn of 2013, modifications of the E400 with the 333-horsepower engine have also joined them. With, in addition, the E250 Blue TEC version has become available for order, equipped with a 4-cylinder 204-horsepower diesel engine and, notably, with all-wheel drive as an option. The range of diesel power units also includes engines with a capacity of 136, 170, 231 and 252 horsepower. The hybrid Mercedes-Benz E300 is powered by a 204 horsepower engine paired with an electric motor. The most powerful in the line of engines of the series was the E550 model, using a 5.5 liter V8 engine with a capacity of 402 horsepower, 300 kilowatts.